Well, self-isolating is my life. I'm a writer, and uh, I don't get to see a lot of people, although I have been taking a Spanish course, and so I have a teacher, but it's a private class, and, uh, you know, hopefully she's not contagious. The weather here has been very rainy off and on for a couple of days. My, my dog's in my lap, so I pay attention to her. Um, and so that's really been helpful in a certain way, uh, because there haven't been a lot of crowds or, or, or people out. Um, but this morning when I was walking along the Maricon, which is sort of the, uh, the pier, the marina, and uh, there were huge, two huge uh, cruise ships in. I mean, one was, I think it was like seven stories tall. And I thought that's the only risk I think we have here, is that this is a cruise ship town. And they come in Wednesdays and Saturdays, usually, or Wednesdays and Sundays. There's a rotation of ships that come in for a day or two, and you sort of see all the tourists uh, out on First Street, a certain part of First Street. It's kind of good because I never find out about the sort of the south part, which is where uh, people like uh, myself uh, hang out and live and go to the coffee shop. So they're all down there buying um, <laughs> stuff that was made in China <laughs> that's supposed to be Mexican. Um, but it is an odd time, and um, this is a very libertarian country, and it's supposed to be a little bit socialist and capitalist at the same time. So finding out, in fact, they have been testing. Um, <laughs> Although I think uh, the, the head of the Mexican Stock Exchange, I think they just got coronavirus. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen. It, it's not the same as living in a city with people aren't, with, there's no subway. Uh, the buses are quite small, although people are taking them. People walk a lot, they bike a lot, and of course there's a lot of cars. So we really don't know. They haven't begun to close schools or anything like that, but they have begun to advise uh, not to go to events indoors. I'm actually going to go to events outdoors in about 10 minutes because I'm getting nutty from, I call it um, cabin fever. I'm getting nutty from being indoors. And I'm used to being indoors, but I'm also used to being able to go out several times a day and I miss the sunshine. Anyway, wherever you are, you know, take precautions. Don't be nuts, but be careful and stay well. And uh, if you encounter a, a virus, don't buy it in town with you. Just let it go with someone. Love you.